Dalton here with ABC Acres. Today we're going to be talking about the function of our passive solar and geothermal greenhouse and the ways that we use the heat and cool throughout the year here in Zone 5, Western Montana. The entire greenhouse is run off just a few temperature switches, an exhaust fan, variable speed, a backup wall heater, both our climate battery heating and cooling. In both the southeast and the southwest corners we have intake points where there is a turbine fan pulling air from in the greenhouse down into 1300 feet of tubing going down nine feet into the ground as backfilled by aggregate rock and sand and acts as our climate battery storing heat. And these are pictures of the intake manifolds underneath the fans. This is where 1,300 feet of tubing all connect. All that tubing is connected to this vent, where the fans will then blow the air through the system and out to heat or cool the greenhouse, depending on our needs for that time of the year. The French drain acts as a cooling system in summer, pulling cool air from outside of the foundation. Even the angle of the greenhouse is specific to our latitude. It allows low winter light to get through to the north passive black wall and radiates heat back into the greenhouse, but it also blocks out the high summer sun to keep temperatures down. A water source in your greenhouse, like a pond, can also help with temperature control, as well as attract amphibians and reptiles. Using these heating and cooling principles in our greenhouse has helped us create and sustain a biodiverse system, including many plants, animals, and insects. Remember to like and follow ABC Acres for more greenhouse content. And leave a comment if you have any questions or would like us to answer anything in future episodes. Thank you.